you know, uh, whole camp with my part of what this, what is a smoke stick? It's a revolutionary device that resembles a traditional cigarette and fully recreates the smoking experience fully smoke without any harmful side effects. It's a clean alternative to traditional cigarette smoking. It's free of carbon monoxide, tar, and cancer causing animals found in traditional cigarettes. So basically, it's also litter free, uh, no ashes, and no. Okay, look, we're talking around our feet right now, there are cigarette tags all over the place. Uh, it's fire free, and the, uh, the smoking is actually a mist of vapor caused, uh, treated as liquid nicotine and propane dichrome. Vaporized by a tiny component called the atomizer. I mean, uh, like the like, 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 there, this is a kit right here. See, this is a kit. And this comes, this is actually right here. This is the battery. Oh. This is the battery. It comes with a, a battery, an atomizer, and everything. So this is, it comes undone like so. This part can plug into the charging unit that has with it, see? You plug it into the charging unit and charge. That's why you have two batteries, so that one battery can be charging while you use the other one. In this unit right here, if I get it, I have to get it undone, is the, uh, okay, here we go. There's a filter in here. And this area right there, oh, I this area home. right here is the filter. You can't see it. There's a small filter, which you got several of in the case, that you put in there. That's where it causes the uh, thing to work. And then once it, it's fully charged, you know, all you have to do to make it work is that. Oh, look at that. See that? See, i would seen them doing that at, at uh, Gibson. So puffs just like a cigarette. Yeah, puffs just like a cigarette. And it depends, they, uh, you know, uh, basically, the mouthpiece contains, a re as I said, a replaceable cartridge filled with liquid. When you take a drag on it, the uh, air is directed through the tiny sensor, and um, it comes out. Well, you know, one it's of the... It's totally harmless. Well, one of the things is, you know, like a cigarette, once you start it, you've got to finish that cigarette, or that cigarette's kind of done with, because it continues smoking. Yeah. Yeah, but, yeah, <laughs> yes, I mean, it also shows... Supposedly, I don't know if you see it, but supposedly this turns red at the end. There might be too much light in here. Yeah. Let me, let but, me uh, uh, do it, it again. Let me pop. You, you get the, on an it. orange LED at the tip of the device is also activate this sample, <laughs> the burning end of a cigarette. I don't know if you can see it here, but there may be too much light out there. It does work though. But that's, that's vapor. That isn't smoke. That's water vapor. Oh, that's pretty cool. Basically, uh, okay. You put the frequency in. This looks like a real expensive filtered cigarette, doesn't it? Oh, yeah. But it's a totally, they say it's totally harmless because there's no, there's no smoke. It's just the taste of what you have. Can you tell the nicotine when you smoke oh, it? Oh, I can taste it, yeah. I can also taste the taste. Okay, if you ever put a cigarette down, put it out, and then relit it again, this is exactly what it tastes like after you have to cut it. What, what do you do when you breathe it? I didn't know you could do that. Yeah, you people will sit there and put cigarettes out. And, uh, okay, there are cigarettes and there are cigarettes. Some cigarettes are worth a lot of money, and they don't smoke them all the way. And they'll sit there, snuff them oh. out, and then put it back in a case. But when they relight it, it has a real taste. Of it. And this it gives you that same taste when you when you don't do it for a while, and then you turn it back on again. That's basically what you're doing. You're turning it over. That's how you turn it on. Yeah. Oh, that's kind of cool. Okay. Uh, are smoke sticks approved by the FA, FDA? Basically, they're they are not under the administration, the Food and Drug Administration, or the alcohol and tobacco because they don't contain tobacco. Uh, oh. Basically, and can a smoke stick really replace my cigarette in terms of taste and smell? Actually, they're available in several cartridges, several, you know, full flavor, medium, light, and menthol are some of the examples available. And uh, basically, uh, you can smoke these things on the direction of the there is no smoke. Water vapor. The traditional wow. smoking being socially unacceptable, we told you that this was a pretty correct way of doing it. Well, actually, you know, part of it, though, is just because you have one of these things, when you go out, 
places that ban cigarette smoking, like restaurants, yeah. you probably, because it looks like you're smoking, you will still probably have to go sit where the yeah, smoke not, is. My guess is they're not going to let you do this in the presence of others. Right, because it still gives you the illusion. I can put it, my, my, we put it, I, 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 you know, I have a little one, I used to have a little one, now it's a little one, a big one. But I used to give her candy cigarettes. So we'd be driving along, and she would puff the, the, the powdered sugar out of the cigarettes, and we'd drive by people. Now, we would get all sorts of nasty looks from people, thinking that I was allowing a little child to smoke. You know? that, I think you would, you know, uh, basically, uh, you know, you, you shouldn't do it indoors, no matter what. But you can eliminate, said, uh, can you save money by switching to electronic smoking? You can eliminate the weekly expense of purchasing cigarettes. And I think it says it depends upon the person, but basically how long would I think it's going to last. You know, this is the legal thing from the company. Although this smoke stick is a healthier alternative to traditional smoking, it's best not to smoke very They don't it mean for you yeah. to buy this so you can simply develop a habit. Their product is intended to be used by adult age 18 or over. They do not market the product to minors. Basically, if you've ever smoked traditional car based cigarettes, you are at risk for or may have already developed blood cancer. Smoke stick does not contain tar or other bulletins of cancer, causing illness to other types of cigarettes. Now, of course, smoke stick cannot reverse damage already done to your body by smoking traditional cigarettes or prevent you from developing cancer as a result of smoking traditional cigarettes. Basically, it is simply a means. That's the difference. Uh, it, I would think it's a great device now to get off. I think this would be better than if you're talking about putting the patch on your arm, which Mr. Obama uses, it doesn't work. Yeah. The only problem I find with this is that, same as I, we've got another company that we've got electronic cigars. The trick is, is that you don't really know how much you smoke. You can actually smoke oh. an entire package of cigarettes. Because like with the cigarette, you know because you finished the cigarette. Yeah, and that's the only thing they've got because, I mean, like, they put a little thing on it somewhere to sell, you know, one quarter, two quarter, three quarter, empty, you know. But this way, you know, like I said, I'm, I'm using it, you know, you know like I, if I was smoking, which I'm not addicted. My father was addicted. My mother was addicted. I simply, I can, I turn it off if I don't want to. That's the difference. But... I have no idea how long the thing is going to last. Then I could sit there, my father would sit there and go, my father would go through three packs of cigarettes a day. Yeah. But my mother would go through one, but my mother would go through one at a time, she stuffed out the end, and then come back and use that one, finish that one, and then do another one later. But you have no way of knowing on this one. It could go, like I said, you could do a whole pack at one time. That's the only thing I have against it. I mean, it, it works. It, it is exactly what they say it is. It has a, a cool factor. It's, it, won't, it shouldn't cause you health problems because, as they say, uh, propylene glycol is used in food, cake mixes, salad dressing, soft drinks, popcorn, really? food coloring, fat-free ice cream with sour cream. It also protects food from freezing and helps in preserving. In toiletries, cosmetics, lotions, creams, baby wipes. Uh, <laughs> Sham shampoos, antiperspirants, cosmetic lip addiction, other. It's in room deodorizers, cleaners, basically propylene glycos and everything you can think of. And they, 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 you know, this is the least harmful form I think they can get a propylene glyco. Because it's actually just in a really, really minute amount just so that you can make them, make it look like it's a... Like it's a cigarette. Yeah, I mean, so first of all, it's never going to make me look like <laughs> No, but I mean... You know, we're, we're trying to do this fair for the smoke stick company. You know, because they've got a product, like I said, it does have, it is it's a good product, it's and it does a have a cool product. effect. Yeah. And it can be used, if it's used in a manner, in one manner, it can help people that have an addiction to smoking. They say that it really isn't meant to do that, but I see it as a device that can be used in that manner. Like I said, I know people that sit there, that have smoked all their life, that are off of it, they sit there and twiddle things in their hands. This can be twiddled. This is something they're used to hold.